Once again, Grapple fans, welcome to your regular Saturday lunchtime helping of professional wrestling. The main course is not to be missed, but to warm us up, let's get ringside for the first contest and alongside the man who saved you your regular seat, Kent Walton. Yes, indeed. Pull up a chair and join us for this all-star wrestling promotions bill from the Lewisham Theatre, Catford, in London. Top of the bill, the all-British clash of two world champions. But the man with the introductions for our first contest, tag team time, is our master of ceremonies, John Harris. And now, ladies and gentlemen, this, of course, now in the ring, we have our tag match. The match is made over a time of 15 minutes and it's going to be decided by just the one single pinfall or submission or knockout. Coming out of the red corner on my left, I introduce to you the combination consisting firstly of the turbulent gentleman from the Midlands, Blondie Barrett. And his partner, of course, you know, that it is Mr. Wonderful, Bobby Barnes. <laughs> and now, from the blue corner, I feel you may perhaps make a different sort of a noise from that, when I ask you to put your hands together in welcome for the team together known as the Young Ones. And individually, they are from Eastbourne, Wayne Martin. And his partner, the Liverpool lad, Robbie Brookside. And your referee for our tag match, Mr. Frank Casey. Thank you, John Harris. So, tag team time here at the Lewisham Theatre, Catford. And we've got quite a bill here for you this afternoon. Bobby Barnes there in his usual jacket. That's his partner, Bob Blondie Barrett from Leicester. And here are these two, Rob Brookside from Liverpool. And nearest to us, Wayne Martin from Eastbourne. The first time we've seen them on the small screen. This is a tag match of 15 minutes duration. One fall, one submission or a knockout decides the winner here. <laughs> Referee Frank Casey still giving the pep talk and everybody's saying get on with it. I don't know what's holding him up. Seconds away, commence wrestling. Frank Casey's still not happy about something. Oh, the belt. Bobby, uh, Blondie Barrett's belt had to come off. So it's Brookside, the young boy versus Bobby Barnes. Bobby Barnes from Maidstone, now residing not too far from where we are here this afternoon, Ocean Theatre. But then he changes his abode so many times that I cannot catch this man up. Anyway, it's Bobby Barnes from Maidstone, Maidstone to me. against this youngster with the long white boots and knee protectors. Rob Brookside from Liverpool. The young lad up against a lot of experience here in his teens, and he's got a lot to learn in the game, but I understand that he's learning it fast. Oh, yes, if Matthew Reed's drop kick. That shook Bobby Vines all right. <laughs> he's going to be really mad after that one. Taking a bit of an arm roll, nicely. And again. <laughs> oh, yes. Bobby Barnes tagging, he's had enough of that. In comes Blondie Barrett. Bob Barrett, nice backdrop. And for the first time, Wayne Martin of Eastbourne enters the ring against Barrett. Boy Wayne Martin, now against Barrett, 18 years old. His partner waiting in the tight rope on the left of your screen, 19. Oh, 
Yes. So it's a nice throw. It's a nice rolling arm moves there by the young lad, Wayne Martin. And Barrett's had him out. In comes Boy Barnes. And oh, experience. Look at that move. Oh, he got that so fast. And Frank Casey, the referee, ran there very fast, inspecting the card possibly. Send me Jeff Stronghold that he got. He won't seem to release it. Not yet, anyway. Now the back cover has been released at force to, and in comes Barrett instead of Barnes. Against him. Martin. And it's Barnes again. Quick, quick tag, perfectly legal. And a tag again. And it's Barrett again against Martin. Barnes out, but he'll be in again in a flash. Across the forehead rather than the throat. That's uh, Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, Bobby Barnes receives his first public warning. Ladies and gentlemen, Blondie Barrett receives his second and final public warning. So Blondie Barrett gets his second and final public warning. the apron gets his last move in before he falls. Wayne Martin in real trouble on that end and they're not going to let him back to his corner if they can possibly avoid it. Barnes a little bit late then, just made it. Remember only a one fall or one submission is necessary here. Nice turn. Hammerlock, very nearly got the hammerlock on there but he couldn't stop Barnes getting to Barrett. So there's the tag. Barrett takes over against Martin. Back over, stomach. In comes the knee. Nice lead. Yes, sir. Well done. Very good. In comes Rob Brookside. And the guillotine. And again, when Matt Martin comes in against Barrett. He really wanted to as well. Couldn't wait. Back elbow. And another tag. Brookside takes over. Ten minutes gone. Ten minutes gone. Five minutes to go. Just one fall to decide this contest. Oh, yes. Oh, punch. Right in on Bobby Barnes. Ladies and gentlemen, With that Bobby punch, Barnes Bobby Barnes sees his second and final cup of corner. So both men on that team have got their Second and final public warning now. And it's such a <laughs> mayhem now. And it's an all nicely over the top. Holding the double leg. Reverse double leg nursing. In fact, Casey counts. And the kids make it. Ten minutes, 40 seconds. End of the box. A 15 minutes duration, and the winners, the kids, the young ones, they're known as, by the one fall required. The young ones make it the beautiful underneath the arms. He takes his man over in reverse double leg Nelson. Very neat. I'm surprised Bobby Barnes was caught like that, but that's the fall. The youngsters, the young ones required. We'll be seeing more of that.